porcher. <laughs> the porcher. <laughs> the porcher. So posh. And it's a full accent here. <laughs> Alright, so I'm currently at the airport in Montego Bay. This is going to be my first time traveling since March. You know, since Jamaica lockdown, I am very nervous about this. I'm gonna document the entire process and show you guys what the process is like and everything. So everything I need, I have my hand sanitizer, I have my face shield, I have my face mask. I'm gonna put on my gloves. I have my wife's sanitizer. I like just can't afford to get anything. So wish me luck and I'm gonna document the entire process for you guys, all right? Like this is where you give them your passport and everything in the line. So if Corona when they give you right here, so oh yes, I'm definitely catch Corona. I swear to you, Corona right here, side. Stand, stand up right here, so no form of social distance or anything. Even if you mention it to the security, they don't. They really don't um, care really. So I'm currently just waiting on my on the plane to start going at 105, and it takes up at 140. And I'm gonna land in for that thing. So far, the experience is not bad. There's not much social distancing and stuff going on. So I'm just here waiting to see. You know, I'm very nervous. I'm going to dispose of one. So I keep removing them. I have like a box, so I keep taking them off and removing them once I have something. So, yeah. So, this is where you walk and to enter the plane you have a security with a sanitizer and the temperature everything inside there right now i'm just basically wiping off the handles and every surface that i'm going to touch with my bare hands i don't know why i gave away my gloves but yeah i have to wipe off everything to keep myself safe and sanitize because i am going to utilize this area so once i'm, it, once I'm going to touch it i'm sanitizing it and then give it to the seals or the air hostess so right now you can see the plane is taking off. We are going, we are going, and we are up, up in the air. So yeah, so this is just the sky view. Right now we just landed in Fort Lauderdale. So I yeah. am in Fort Lauderdale International Airport right now. Uh, I just rechecked my bag. I know I'm going, I have a layover for three hours. So I'm gonna be in this airport for a while. So I need to go see it, grab food, I need to find my gate, I need to get settled, and so forth. So, yeah, so far I'm gonna take my catch Corona, so. And I'm just inside of a restaurant. Um, I'm just grabbing some chips. Uh, the check-in process was good and everything. Social distancing was all right. The, it wasn't a very long and awful flight. Mm, in Montego Bay, there wasn't much social distancing and stuff like that going on. What they did was board the plane um, row by row, so they start at the back to the front. So, yeah. So right now I'm just grabbing something to eat, and then uh, I have a layover for three hours, and then <coughs> I arrive in Atlanta at tonight at 11:30. So it's gonna be an extremely long day. So yeah. Yes, it is now 11:35. PM and the airport is absolutely empty. Yeah, so the airport is empty, 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 empty. Um, there's a lot of sanitizers and dispensers and stuff like that. In this airport, I am exhausted. I've been traveling all morning. My foot hurts. I am nauseous. I'm exhausted, I'm hungry, I just want to vomit, so yeah.
good morning yeah man so good morning to everybody that's watching me right now um i just woke up i'm a bit hungry i'm not feeling very good i've been vomiting since last night due to my house so if you don't know what that is research it it's as a result so i'm going to grab breakfast i'm thinking about iops or waffle house to grab breakfast and then i'm gonna go to the apple store because i have two I have stuff to do at the apple store and then i'm gonna go shopping so i'm gonna take you along with me so stay tuned Probably can get the tight suit for mommy. Yeah, something like that. So I'm gonna probably bother her for a second, ask her where she can, where we can get it. So today I am driving around trying to get a COVID test in order for me to go back home to Jamaica. It is mandatory. So Damien here is with me. Um, trying to find ID location for me to get it done. So I'll keep you guys posted on it. So yeah, push me look. In a, in a, by in a week. By in a week. My COVID test take three to five days if you come back. What you go coming at three days? Me not know. Three to five. 
I can't say a three day. Hold on, no. I can't say three day, book the ticket back for three day, and then three day come with COVID, and I come one with no. <laughs> and then I've got to do travel authorization before, so probably in the next five years. So I probably both. You give me blood clot money? Blah 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 so yeah, yesterday I tried getting a COVID test. It didn't work out. Apparently I need a COVID test to get back home to Jamaica. So right now I'm rushing. I found a place where we can get a COVID test. So um, I'm gonna have Damien bring me and see if we can get one done. And I'm gonna show you guys the process and keep you up to date. So fingers crossed, hopefully it's not that bad as how it seems on the internet. So yeah, I gotta do a COVID test. <laughs> So we are here at the drive through COVID testing area. We have never done one before, so I'm kind of nervous based on the videos that I've seen on the internet. And then push that long thing down on the board. No as well. So yeah, I'm gonna keep you guys posted on it. Yeah. Okay. You received your results by email and three to five business days. Okay. We have not received it within seven days. There's number nothing to call. Okay. Don't call that paperwork and keep it in your mouth. Keep your mouth covered. Bumbo clock, 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 Burns anytime you put something in your nose. Oh God! You got you was able to record. It? I don't Yo, I don't wish that COVID thing on nobody. I mean, in all that 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 bad, but in all that 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 good, like. So I'm trying to get a suitcase for myself and chemo. It's between this, which Damien also wants. This, uh, they have three persons who want this suitcase. Between the Steve Madden and the um, I'm gravitating to the Tommy ones too. No, the nautical ones. But I'm not sure which one because if I should choose, I would choose this one. mainly because I name and they have the Steve Manwich you know the one I miss this, 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 this. but this one this one is bigger so I will choose this because it's bigger I will choose this because it's black and nicer 
and I would choose that one. <laughs> because of the color. So yeah, it's so weird since I've done the COVID test. I feel like I actually have COVID now. My throat itches. I feel like I'm having the flu, which is very weird. <coughs> it's so, a mind thing. I don't know. It is. Because they, they shove it all the way up and then the, the, the I want to come in here. And then yeah. The throat kind of. Um, no. It's just weird. And I like this one because this can fuck almost everything in it. Oslan care, everything. So, yeah. So, this is what I'm doing today. So, I'll keep you guys posted throughout the day. By the time you guys see this video, I'm probably it's going to be 14 days later while I'm already in Jamaica quarantine and everything. So, yeah, you can't talk shit. So, just an update i when i did before i did the covid test i was perfectly fine i had no symptoms nothing of that nature nothing at all but since i did it since i got the test done my head hurt my throat hurts i keep coughing runny nose runny eyes so i'm, I'm not sure what's happening right now but um yeah so and i keep i think i have shot a breath so i'm just watching it to see what's really happening because, because i was perfectly fine like two hours ago, right? So. so I'm in a Jamaican restaurant right now. Like, I mean, it's the food seems pretty good. Um, like, me not, me not love foreign food, man. Foreign food don't nice. So, maybe I get some soup and some patty and everything. Like, they have everything I can think of over here. So, is it me? I get some food. No, them they are different, but them, yeah. them they are Easter, but So I did manage to get but my COVID test. Luckily, I am negative. I did went ahead and fill out my application form to enter um, Jamaica's soil. And I was waiting my acceptance certification. It just came in my email. So, yeah, when it comes on to the process of traveling to Jamaica, it is much more technical and hectic than traveling outside of um traveling from jamaica but going into the country it's a bit different during covid because i just literally bought my plane ticket and fl flew out but back i have to do the covid i have to check in online i have to download an app and the questions are very direct they want to know which person's living in your house um do you have a bathroom your age look everything they need to know every single thing so they can track you and stuff like that so yeah i did get my, my test and everything so i can shuffle home so thank god for that all right so i'm currently at the airport waiting on my flight my flight is at eight o'clock it is now 7 15. um the process was a very quick and easy process um there is not a lot of social distancing and sanitizing or anything of that nature it was very packed and crowded so you just have to keep yourself safe throughout this time during the airport and uh, yeah once you enter once you're gonna um enter the jet flight though 
you are going to get um, unsanitized and other stuff if you don't have any. Also, one key thing to note, um, upon a, once you are checking in, you're going to need to present your COVID, you're going to need to present your negative COVID results along with um, your travel authorization. So I did have those in my email, so I just pulled them up and showed it to them. So yeah, I'm good to go. So I'm not sure what to expect when I get to Jamaica because I know Jamaica is more stricter um, when it comes on to the whole COVID, COVID thing. So I'm a bit nervous of, of how that's going to go. So stay tuned. Ouch. Remove the vest and pull it over your head. Wrap the strap around your waist. Secure the buckle and pull the strap to tighten. As you exit the aircraft, inflate the vest by pulling down firmly on the red tabs or blowing into the tubes on both sides. A locator light on the shoulder. The sun hot, black hat. I just saw. Just to give you guys an update, it has been 14 days since I've been back in Jamaica. 16 days since I've done my COVID test. Currently, I have no signs of any symptoms or anything. I'm in good health, good standard, everything. So thanks be to God. Um, so I can finally post this video. So now I can have a property. So um, yeah. Thank you guys for watching, supporting, subscribing. Let me know what other thing you want to see. Um, yeah, especially the other property. So, um, yeah. Thank you guys for watching, supporting, subscribing. Let me know what other thing you want to see. Um, yeah.